any sports? Could you please state your name and what school you're from? Uh, Sean Wiseman, Arlington Country Day School. Coach, how many years have you been coaching? Uh, this will be my 12th, 12th year. Now, what school were you at last year, Coach? Uh, West Oaks Academy in Orlando, Florida. So you made the jump to Arlington Country Day. This past year, how's that been for you? Transition? Uh, it's it's been great. Uh, we we liked uh, my family liked living in Orlando. We we you know we we, we like Jacksonville. Uh, you know the schools are very similar. Uh, so, but uh, just uh, uh, you know it's not been much transition with the with the, as far as the school piece or, or, or the basketball piece. You know, we're, we're, but uh, just you know your your families uh, was the main thing I was worried about. Coach, I know in the SIAA um, we kind of start all over every year with our teams. There's a lot of times not a strong core returning, especially you being in a new school. Do you, how do you feel about your team at this stage in the career, in the year? I know it's early. I, I feel good. Uh, we've got a few – uh, a few kids we're waiting on right now that, that, that you know, either in the process of uh, getting their I-20s or in the process of transferring. Uh, you know, once we get those, all those pieces together, I, I really feel good about our team uh, and where, where we're going uh, and what we're doing uh, in Jacksonville. Well, I know early on in the year, you know, a lot of times teams are better defensively because offensively we're really just putting our kids together and, and trying to jail. Where are you looking to get your offensive production this year? Uh, well, we, we've got uh, we, our guards are really good. Uh, uh, you know, we've got we've got a good uh, you know three se uh, three seniors and, and two underclassmen. Um, you know, uh, Lugans Dort, uh, you know, sophomores is, is going to be really good. We're, we're looking for him to you know score on the perimeter. Uh, you know, Ty Gatson's really taking a leadership role from a uh, just kind of running our team and, and getting the other people. Uh, you know, Austin Davis. Uh, you know, he'll he'll be a you know a, a big factor on the perimeter as well. Uh, so our, our guard play is going to be really good. You know, probably you know manufactured most of the points, uh, but uh, I've really been uh, surprised with with Koch, Barr, who I had last year at West Oaks with me. Uh, you know how much he's uh, you know he, he's grown and matured, and uh, his skill set's gotten better. He's really scoring a lot of points here in the preseason. We've had three or four scrimmage games, and he's been in double figures all game, all, all you know every game. Now, coach, I know you mentioned last year at West Oaks. You guys were fortunate enough to win the state title last year there. And I know you brought Koch with you. Realistically, do you think this year's team for you at ACD has a chance to win a state title? Oh, I, I think every year that, uh, you know, I, I coached in the, in the independent league in North Carolina and, and now I'm in the independent league here in Florida. And every year, uh, you know, our, our goal is to win a state title. And, and that's, that's, that's our goal and that's what we're going to do. And uh, that's what we're you know, shooting for. That's what we're aiming for now. Things happen along the way. It's a marathon. It's not a sprint. Uh, you, you know, kids get hurt. Uh, you know, things happen. Uh, you know, the, during the course of the year. So we, we've just, you know, we, we are on our voyage here to start the season, and, and uh, you know, we'll see what happens. We want to be good at the end of February. That's when we want to be good. So now, changing gears a little bit, coach. Just want to talk about the league a little bit. Uh, you've been part of the SIAA now for for three years. How do you feel about the uh, the way the SIAA is headed with two divisions, the North and the South, with a crossover? Game? I, I think it's – man, I, you know what? Uh, the first year I was in the SIAA, uh, I coached – like I said, I coached in the Independent League in North Carolina for nine years. And I went 12-4 and four in the league and, and finished the game out of first place. And I felt like I needed a gold medal or, or, or some, some, some kind of, you know, constellation prize or something because it was just – it was, it was tough. Uh, it was brutal. Every game is, is, is good. Uh, this league, where it's going, where it's heading, and, and, and it's still a baby – uh, but where it's going, it, you know, I think, and I've, you know, every coach in the league, sh you know, hopefully, you know, shares the same sentiment that, that you know, we're, we're on to something here, and th this league is is good, it's competitive, uh, and uh, you know, it, I'm you know grateful to you know to play in it, and, and uh, you know, uh, it, it's uh, it, it's a good thing for our kids. Coach, last question, and I want to leave all viewers with this: if you could describe your team. Or what you want them to represent your school and you as a coach in one word. What word would that be? Uh, intensity. We we just you know we want to play hard. We want to be you know we, we want to be uh, just you know we want to everything we do whether it's academics, athletics, even you know it, it, even uh, just you know extracurricular activities. We want to go hard and uh, uh, we just we want to approach you know, things on a day to day basis uh, in, in that way. And uh, I think that's the one thing. They'll say when they leave my program uh, is they learn how to practice hard, they learn how to play hard, 
and, and they'll uh, they'll be you know better college players for for uh, you know being at Arlington Country Day School. Coach, we really appreciate you coming to the 2015 Media Day, SNLA Media Day. We thank you for your time and good luck. I yeah, appreciate it. Coach, you have one Coach Weiss, when you're inheriting a very successful program at Arlington Country Day, what do you think it will take for you to put your stamp on it to make it your own? Well, I'm, I'm not trying to make it, you know, my own. I want my stamp on it. I, I mean, everybody knows when they when they see one of my teams, you know, how they're going to play, what they're going to do. Uh, I, I'm not trying to reinvent the wheel here. Uh, Rex is, uh, you know, Rex started this league, uh, and, and Rex uh, Morgan is, is uh, you know, just, you know, it started off as a, uh, you know, you get, you get to know Rex, you know, and, and uh, you know, I became a friend with Rex. And uh, when, when they called me up and asked me to do this, uh, last spring, I, you know, I, I, sometimes you just got to do the right thing. So uh, it, it's not so much, you know, my stamp or, you know, basketball's been played at Arlington Country Day School now for 15 years. Uh, this is probably, the, you know, the 16-year high school program, uh, one of the more uh, successful programs in, in the state, if not the country. So uh, I'm very fortunate to be able to, you know, take over, uh, you know, uh, for Rex. And, and uh, uh, you know, he, he's still around the guys. He's, uh, you know, he, I know he misses it. Uh, and uh, but uh, you know I, I just uh, you know I'm very grateful for the opportunity and, and uh, you know look forward to you know uh, you know coaching at uh, ACD for years to come. Thank you. All right, we're good. Yeah, we're good. All right, thank you.